What's up guys, it's your boy CeeLo. And it's your boy Steph. Thank you guys for tuning in to another edition of Bros Guys Souls. And today we have a few upcoming sneaker releases lined up for you guys. And we're going to tell you if it's a cop, cop or drop. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, so we're going to start with the Jordan 4 Motorsports. Yeah. I'm going to have to go with the drop. Aww. Unfortunately, man, the Motorsports... Uh, just the excitement is, is over with it. Uh, I liked it when they were a little bit more exclusive. And just that colorway, I don't see myself rocking it. I'm going to go with the cop. I'm a fan of the Jordan 4. And the silhouette looks clean. I can wear it. I'll go with the cop. And next we have the, ooh, just the, the beautiful, the Royal Ones. <sighs> no thought about it, man. Got to go with the cop. These just bring back so many nostalgia memories, man. I just remember in 2001, they actually numbered these from like one to 50,000. And then me and my brother, we had like 20,000 or something. And then my cousin like beat his up, shout out to Lurch. And then he like, like he cut the grass in him, just, just dogged him. And then he looked inside and he goes, bro, I have number one. Oh my god, it was too late, the shoes were done. Oh, rest in peace, man. <laughs> so the shoes, not his cousin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with a cop. Jordan ones are just a dope, classic silhouette, and just the royal colorway, having the braids and the royals, that's a cop. All right, so the next one we have is a Jordan 11. A lot of people love the Jordan 11s, one of the most iconic silhouettes out there. But, this one's a low top. We got the UNC 11s. Uh, for me, I'm gonna do a drop, Aww. mainly just because I like some low top versions of the Jordan silhouettes, but this 11 and just this colorway, I'm just not too much of a fan. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree. That's a drop. Aww. I'm not a big fan of low top Jordans. Uh, it's super rare that I maybe like a colorway, but I just can't see myself rocking it. So that is a drop, sir. Don't get me wrong. It looks cool. Just for us, personally, it's a drop. And then next on the list, we do have the Pantone 7s. Uh, for me, I'm gonna have the drop. Oh. I'm sorry. I gotta drop again. Uh, that baby blue, I love that Carolina colorway. But just rocking that, and then you got the white bottom. I'm not a big fan of white. The white's gonna get dirty pretty fast. I'm gonna have to uh, behind the back doors. I agree. It's a drop. Aww. I like the silhouette. I love it. It looks cool. It's just, I cannot rock that colorway. I just can't wear it. Same thing with the UNCs. Just that colorway for me. It's not my favorite. Well, it's one of my favorites, but it's not my favorite to rock. So, drop. All right, guys. So, getting into the other brands, a little bit of variety. We're going to dive into the Adidas EQT, the Turbo Red. Oh, man. These are beautiful. <laughs> I'm going with the cop. I wish I had the black colorway. If I had to choose between the two, I would go with the black. But this colorway is still clean, simple. And that boost, I'm hearing these are more comfortable than Ultra Boost. So I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have to give it a try. I'm going with the cop. Bam! I'm gonna go with the cop as well. I, guys, <laughs> guys, the silhouette is crazy. It looks dope, it has boost. Um, I'm a fan of all white shoes. Um, just go with a cop. It's as simple as that. All right, so next one on the list is an Adidas City Sock Mickey Type, I believe it's called. Mickey Type, if I'm pronouncing that wrong, correct me in the comments or don't. I don't really care. But for me, I'm going to have to go with a drop on this Aww. one. I like the silhouette. I think it's cool. I can probably wear some colorways, but for me, the black and white combo. Uh, I'll, I'll, easy pass. It's something different. I give it that. Um, but I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna do something a little different. I'm gonna go with the cop. I like it. I like the design they have on the inside, like on the, on the midsole and inner midsole. It's a clean design. Something simple. Uh, you can kind of dress it up a little high fashion style with it. So I'm gonna go with the cop. Next is gonna be the copper foams. Ugh. This is a tough one, man, because I love this colorway. I think it's a beautiful shoe. 
but the way it's constructed, the quality, the material they're using, and that blue sole, oh, it's a travesty. It's, why, Nike? Just why, man? So, I'm gonna have to go with drop. Oh. That's an L right there, man. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to go with drop as well. Oh. I'm not a fan of that blue sole they've been putting on foams. Um, they did the same thing with the Royal. It's not the same for me, so drop. Next, we do have the Nike Up Tempo Chicago Bull colorway. Uh, I love red, you know, red and black is my colors, but unfortunately, man, this colorway, I just can't get down with it, so I'm gonna go with the drop. Oh. It's only a few colorways I like from the up tempos. That's the Olympic and the classic black and white. Uh, so those are gonna have to get the drop. I'm gonna go with drop as well, oh. mainly because the up tempo for me, I can't really wear it, but I do like the Olympic colorway as well as the classic black and white. Um, I'm not gonna discriminate on the colorway. I love the colorway, but it's a drop for me. All right, guys. So we're up to our last sneaker, probably the most sought-after sneaker out there. It's gonna be, bam, the all-white Adidas Yeezy V2. I'm a fan of all-white. It will get dirty though, but I'm a fan of all-white. So I'm gonna go with a cop. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's dope. <sighs> I feel you, sir. But. I'm gonna have to go with it. Oh, I'm lying. <laughs> it's a cop, it's a cop. But for me, I personally wouldn't rock it. You know, I can't do the all white shoes, man. Uh, if it was like a cream or if it had like a different sole or something like that, then maybe. But the reason I would cop this shoe, you know, maybe it's a little high beast, but I would cop it to maybe, you know, swap with a different colorway of a Yeezy V2 or, you know, I would use it as like trade bait. Uh, so that's the only reason I would cop this sneaker. Or to be honest, we just have a little Kevin Wilson in us. Yeah, look. <laughs> nah, but you know, overall dope sneakers coming out. Uh, let us know what you guys think. Leave a comment down below. Are you guys copping, dropping? Do you agree with us? Do you disagree with us? Let us know. Give us your opinion because this is our opinion. So you can, you know, agree or disagree. It doesn't really matter. We're going to cop and drop. Let us know. You let us know. Well, there you guys have it. Let us know what you guys think. You think, you know, did we make the right choices? Should we have dropped a few that we said we're going to cop or drop? You hear what I'm saying? But leave a comment down below. What do you guys think? What sneakers would you have copped and would you have dropped from what we chose from the upcoming sneaker releases? Let us know. With that being said, guys, give this video a huge thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let us know what you guys think. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Click that notification button as well. It'll notify you every time we drop a video. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Drop. Hopefully it comes out good. <laughs> <laughs> good intentions, good intentions.